For a vehicle like the new Mercedes AMG GT, the ultimate driving performance and the ultimate comfort on driving on regular roads is maybe one of the major challenges. In order to compete with these challenges, it's you know, essential that you have a real good setup from the car from the very beginning. Let me show you what I mean. For example, our trans-axle powertrain is one of the key essentials of this car. We have a front mid engine in the front connected with a torque tube to a gearbox on the rear end of the vehicle. With this power setup, we will have the perfect uh, weight balance. For example, 47% on the front axle, 53% on the rear axle. That gives you already a very good balance for the vehicle and this is, as I said, the essential for driving performance, but it also makes it easier to give you a comfortable setup for regular driving. The key advantage for driving performance is the low center of gravity. This is achieved by the uh, oil sample application that we have here. Of course, the uh, axle setup itself is also very important. For, let me give you one example here. We have a very direct linkage of the damper to the wheel. That means any wheel movement is directly put into a damper movement. So we achieve perfect wheel control in order also to be able to give you a maximum performance in comfort. The chassis is a double wishbone chassis on front and on rear axle. I can show it to you here. You can see the two wishbones up here. Uh, also the torsion bar and the connection of the steering to the suspension. The AMG chassis control is an ECU, an electronic control unit that collects all the sensor information and all the setup information. It calculates it, it computes it, and it gives out all the information again to the actuators. Uh, if you want to have a comparison, it's basically the brain of the vehicle. It's the brain that stands behind our driving performance. The AMG Dynamic Plus package incorporates a lot of different uh, systems. Let me give you some examples. Uh, we have a different setup for the engine. We have a changed camper of the front axle. We have an optimized steering. But uh, personally, for me, the technical highlight are the four mounts that we have. We have four active mounts, two on the front, two on the back. And the engine with the torque tube and the rear box uh, are mounted to these four active mounts. So we can individually control these four mounts. For example, if you go on a regular highway, uh, you cruise along, you want to have maximum comfort. That means any little vibrations that come from the powertrain, we make these active mounts really, really soft so you're not disturbed. If we have bigger movements, we can immediately, within one millisecond, really dampen these movements and stiffen, for example, these mounts. If you're on a racetrack, uh, the four mounts are really put to its maximum stiff mode so that we really directly link the drivetrain to the vehicle. That gives you a maximum and precise response and a pure, real feedback to the driver. The key component within these active mounts is a magnetic fluid. And this is influenced by an electronical field, magnetic field, and we can stiffen it or soften it uh, within a millisecond. But all these systems, they don't really play together if you don't take care of all these setups in your development processes. That's the reason why we introduced a new person. It's our uh, vehicle dynamic integrator. This person ensures that all the teams have one common goal. He's the guy that makes the decisions if you have to do certain setups in order to get all these things in one perfect system to achieve this maximum driving performance.